Disclaimer, the following video will be a skit and thank you so much for the suggestion. Hey guys, it's your XOXO Cloudy Fidgets and I'm here at the Trading Hut. Hmm. Wait, there's an alert at this announcement board. One alert, click to check. Let's check it guys. New fidget school, you can join by pressing here. Guys, I've never heard about a fidget school before, so let's go ahead and join. Whoa, welcome to the fidget school. Guys, this place is so cool. Wait, you will receive a new fidget every day and you can store them in this container. Guys, there's a schedule. So we will have fidget trading, making your own fidgets, how to run a fidget shop, lunch plus break, fidget cooking, and last but not least, fidget hunting. Guys, I cannot wait for the day to start. It's currently 8.25 a.m. and we have 5 more minutes until fidget trading. Hold on, but I don't have any fidgets to trade. Hmm. Whoa, what is this? Wait, I think they mentioned that we will be receiving a new fidget every day. And this is today's fidget. Let's put that here. And let's go to fidget trading. Okay guys, we're here at fidget trading. And I have here our fidget and our basket with me. Let's go ahead and see if anyone have an offer for this. Trading giant stress ball. Me, 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 I have an offer. I'll offer you this blue water snake. This sensory pad. And this pink marble mesh. Guys, I think that's a good offer since they have multiple fidgets. So I'm going to accept. Okay, now let's trade these three fidgets. Trading three fidgets, do anyone have an offer? Me, please, I have an offer. I'll offer you this color changing needle, this snapper, this infinity cube, and this tangle. Oh my goodness, of course, accept. Guys, now we have all of these four fidgets. And I really love how this changes color when you squish it. Oh my goodness, can I please offer for your fidgets? Sure, of course. What's your offer? I'll offer you this blue color changing needle. This mini pineapple poppet. These two mini stress balls. And last but not least, a fidget cube. Guys, her offer is amazing. I'm going to accept. Guys, now we have all of these fidgets. Let's put them inside our fidget basket. Hmm. Wait. Class ended. Have fun in your next class. Okay, guys, and our next class is making your own fidgets. So let's go ahead and join. Whoa, guys, I'm in the making your own fidgets class. Wait, what are all of these? Hey, everyone, I'm the teacher of this class, and today we're going to be making a homemade sensory pad. So we will be starting with this reusable Ziploc bag. And the reason why we're using the reusable ones is because the normal ones pop more easily. Then we have some water and some food coloring. But food coloring is completely optional. And fill it less than halfway. Now you can place in a few drops of food coloring. I placed in one drop and now let's mix it together. And we're going to take some air out of the bag by doing this and sealing it. So now you have your own homemade sensory pad fidget. Guys, I just made it and it's so fun. I love this class. And I heard you can even put Orbeez inside. Hmm. Wait, class just ended again. And let's put this inside the fidget basket. I can't believe we have so many fidgets already. It's just been two classes. Anyways, now let's go to... Hmm. How to run a fidget shop. Whoa, there's a shelf here. And it's empty. Hey guys, I'm your teacher for this course, and in this class you will learn how to run your own fidget shop. So as you can see, the shelves are all empty right now. And this is because we have all of the fidgets here. And the first step is to restock your items. So that means you can start by putting the fidgets anywhere on the shelves. Guys, this seems so fun. Let's first organize the poppets. I'm going to place the food poppets here. Now let's place the stress balls right here. Okay, now I'm just going to place the rest of the poppets over here. Let's place the shape ones here. 
The animal poppets right here. The mini poppets right here. And last but not least, let's put the monkey noodles and the mochis right here. All right, and we're all set. You guys all did an amazing job on organizing the fidgets. Before we begin, there's a few notes. Please make sure to be respectful, know where your fidgets are, and also the checkout place is right here. And now I'll pretend to be a customer and see how you guys run your shop. Guys, this is so exciting and okay, I know where I put my fidgets. Okay, so we have the food poppets right here, the stress balls, the shape poppets, the animal poppets, the mini poppets, and the monkey noodles, as well as some mochis. Okay, guys, we got this. Guys, I'm going to be the best person on running my own shop. And I'm definitely going to be getting the most tickets. Okay, so the teacher's coming and I better know where I put my fidgets. Hi, I really like your shop. Could you please show me all of your monkey noodles? Okay, just monkey noodles, right? They're right here. Wait, um, where are they? Oh, wait, never mind. They're here. We have this... Wait, what is this called again? But anyways, we have a blue regular monkey noodle. Also, if you're going to buy them, just put them right in here. Oops. Well, good try. It's your first day. Actually, this place is for tickets, not for fidgets. So I'm going to go to another shop. What? No, you can't just leave like that. You didn't even pay. Um, hello? Well, whatever. Wow, I really like your shop. I'm interested in buying the mini poppets. Do you know where you keep them? Well, hi there. We have the mini poppets right here. We currently have a strawberry mini poppet and a cupcake mini poppet in stock. Wow, this is amazing. Thank you so much. I think I'm going to be getting this cupcake one. Also, is this a checkout area? Yes, it is. So you can put your tickets right in here and you can also scan your fidget here. Wow, this is amazing. Thank you so much. And my total was five tickets. Guys, it's our first class on running the shop and we already got five tickets. I also heard you can use this ticket to buy fidgets at the fidget fair. Anyways, let's put it right here in our basket. Okay guys, class just ended. And well, what's our next class? Hmm, oh, we have lunch and break now. Okay, so let's go ahead and go to the cafeteria. Whoa guys, we're here at the cafeteria. I'm going to grab a food tray. Let's get two burger buns. Hmm, what should we add in here? I think I'm going to get some vegetables. Whoa, let's also add in some sauce. Let's get this. And let's put some inside. Okay, we just put the sauce in there. Whoa, let's get this patty. Put that here. And I think that's enough for the burger. So let's put this bun right on top. Next, I'm thinking on getting some fruits and some desserts. Let's get a strawberry. And let's also get a cake roll. I'm going to get the matcha one. And I think these will be enough. So let's go and find some tables to eat this. Let's go here. Whoa, guys, that was really good. Now let's eat the strawberry. And last but not least, the cake roll. Guys, that was all so good. But I think lunch is ending soon, so let's go ahead and return the tray. Let's put it back here. And let's collect our fidgets. Our next class is fidget cooking, so let's go ahead and go there. Okay guys, we're here at fidget cooking. Hey guys, welcome to fidget cooking and I'm your teacher. You may have noticed that there's a bowl and also three fruits. So in today's class, we're going to experiment making smoothies. You can place in any fruits where as much as any fruits you want in the bowl. Then you want to mash it with a spoon and also add in some milk. You can also pour your smoothies in here and try it afterwards. Have fun guys! 
Oh my goodness, you guys, I'm so excited to try it out. Hmm, I think I'm going to start off by putting in the strawberry. And let's mash it with the spoon. Okay, so we got here the strawberry. And let's also add in the banana. And here is the banana. And now let's add in some milk. Let's pour it. Okay, now let's finally mix it together. Whoa. And now let's pour it into the cup to try. Okay guys, we got the smoothie right here and let's try it. Quick disclaimer again, this video is a skit and please don't eat fidgets in real life. But anyways, let's try this. Guys, that was so good and I would definitely call it a success. Whoa, class just ended. And I believe we still have one last class together. And that class is fidget hunting. Let's go guys. Whoa, I think you're supposed to find fidgets here. Well, there's no teacher right here, so let's just find fidgets. Well, I don't see anything here at the moment. Hmm. Wait, there's a textured monkey noodle. We already found one fidget, and let's add that to our basket. Now I wonder if there are more fidgets over there. Hmm. Wait. There's a marble mesh. Let's also add that in. Hmm, I wonder what will happen if we go down the stairs. Hmm, I don't see any fidgets. Speaking of that, there's a fidget right there. Let's put that right inside. Let's keep finding more fidgets. Hmm, I don't seem to be finding any. Hmm, wait. There's a simple dimple. Let's put that in the basket. Hmm. Hold on. There's a mermaid poppet. I'm so happy we found this. And now I think class is ending soon, so let's go. No way. There is a simple digit. Let's add that in. But anyways, class just ended and I'm gonna go home now. Thank you guys so much for watching. And comment for maybe a part two. Anyways, bye guys.